we have this Lennox unit and when you turn on this unit what happens it just hums doesn't start so it hums once in a while trying to start so most likely the problem is capacitor we gotta open this lid taking these two screws out and to find our capacitor don't forget to turn off power to your AC unit this is a capacitor usually you can say it's bad by looking at it sometimes they get swollen so to take capacitor you need to take one screw out always take a lot of photos which wire goes where usually there's three terminals C is common it will have terminals that has four pins uh, usually then it's Herm it will have terminal with usually three pins and Herm goes to compressor and fan usually it has terminal with two pins or one pin and usually you can see on a capacitor itself terminals will be marked okay let's remove our capacitor so when we replace capacitor we want to make sure that new one is same as the old one this one says 70 plus 10 so 70 is the compressor side 10 is the fan side and you can see by looking at this capacitor that it's swollen a little bit you can also check your meter you can also use your meter to check capacitor so we're going to use new capacitor i don't have exactly the same one 70 plus 10 i only have 70 plus 5 so what i'll have to do is i'll have to use two capacitors and i'll have to connect them in between so this capacitor is 10 and this one is dual capacitor i'm only going to use the side that goes to compressor which is Herman common i'm not going to use the fan side because it's only five microfarads and we need 10 so what i'm going to do i'm going to use the common side and i'm going to connect both capacitors on a common side so now common Herm is 70 and common and this capacitor which is 10 is gonna be 70 plus 10 and I'm not going to use the fan side if you get right size capacitor from the very beginning 70 plus 10 you won't have to go through this step so both capacitors are secured be very careful when you put new screws inside the AC unit. You want to make sure that there's no coil or wires on the other side. So now we can connect wires back. Fan goes to the other capacitor, which is 10 microfarads. Common stays the same. Common and compressor side, which is Herm, goes to Herm. So this way our new part have same specs we only use 70 microfarad side of dual run capacitor for compressor and we used other 10 microfarad capacitor for the fan so now let's try to start the unit here we go everything is running spinning 